So this is the office in Weehawken. From what I've been told and what I can figure out, the water went up about 18 inches. This is the record room. Um, that 18 inches clearly included everything on the floor. Um, I spy Curtis Mayfield. I spy the Loretta Lynn that I got the other day, John Prine, Quicksilver, oh, Miles Davis, anything on the bottom row of, of the shelving, which includes everything from the end of the T's through the end of the out, uh, through Z, uh, over on this side, um, you know, I, it's like part of me doesn't want to step on the records, and then part of me is sitting here saying, well, you know, I'm not going to do any more damage. Let's see what happened over here. Um, now, are these wet? These over here, I know it's a little difficult to see. Um, they're a little musty, but it would seem that, yeah, they, they definitely got wet. So over here in this section are the seven inch singles and it would be all the jazz seven inches and all the ska and two-tone so that means the complete two-tone collection is now gone uh, moving into my office uh, so going up 18 inches it feels like hmm, interesting in here it doesn't feel as bad Definitely the bottom row of fanzines, and then the end of the compilations over there are now trashed. Um, anything that was on the floor, nice record collector, some mojos. Um, sad irony uh, of things. My autographed copy of the Herman Leonard Book of Jazz Memories, autographed by Herman Leonard, who, of course... His studios got destroyed during Katrina. Um, and now, this now is trashed. Um, oh, original watercolors by James Audubon. John, John James Audubon. Um, over here, uh, oh, Probably another couple of hundred, you know, I don't know, 400 records that had not been filed away yet. Um, the jukebox clearly got water damage. And... But whether or not the records themselves got trashed, I kind of doubt it. It definitely seems like it might have, yeah, because there, there's no, yeah, no, it definitely looks like there's a line. So there's going to be, you know, part of the, the records in the jukebox, which of course are the prime records. Okay, there you go. I know this went on a bit long. Bye-bye.